NOPD body cam and dash cam video captured a chaotic and violent domestic shooting from Memorial Day in Gentilly, forcing two rookie NOPD officers to act within seconds of arriving to the scene. Investigative reporter Mike Pearlstein has that story. The gunfire breaks out the second New Orleans police officers, Hector Acosta and Tori Riley, pulled up to the scene of a domestic violence call. Both officers had about a year on the force, and as the video shows, they encountered gunfire almost as soon as they left their vehicles. Upon releasing the video today, Chief Sean Ferguson said the officers fired four or five shots each, one bullet wounding the suspect, 30-year-old Wilton Anderson, in the left thigh. Upon exiting their vehicles, they were fired upon. There was no time for our officers to react in any way to defend themselves besides using their weapons. One of the shots fired by Anderson as he chased his sister hit her in the abdomen. She remains in the hospital after recovering from critical injuries. It is a horrible situation. You, you think about this family is completely torn now. Can you imagine parents being having to make a decision between the, the children, children in which they have given birth to? You know, one being the perpetrator, the other being the the victim. While the officers remain on desk duty, Ferguson said he met with them and offered his support as they process their harrowing encounter. Mike Pearlstein, Eyewitness News. While the suspect remains in jail, booked with attempted murder of his sister and aggravated assault on the two officers. As per department policy, the officers will remain on desk duty until that investigation is complete.